I am Surbi. I finished my bachelor's in agriculture from Jawaharlal Nehru Krishi Vishwavidyalay, Jabalpur, Madhya Pradesh, in 2023, and I appeared for the ICR JRF Agronomy in 2023, and I secured AIR 30. And here I'm going to tell you how I did, what I did, and please avoid this turbulence you'll hear throughout the interview because I am actually shooting in my college campus right now. Since you can see it. I have been a tricky agriculture student since the last uh, two years. I joined them when I was in third year of my bachelor's education, and I have been a student ever since till actually the very last day of my exam, right before my exam. And the books that I referred to were actually referred to me by my tutors from Tricky Agriculture. I started off with Ready and Ready. to clear up my concepts and then i went forward to agronomy facts by rs meena and uh, soil science treatise i have loved soil science treatise like actually and um, then i went off to agronomy in brief and agronomy in seconds so the sequence should be you should start off with ready and ready to clear your concepts okay you cannot jump off to rs meena because it's just full of facts to understand that and to actually learn the facts in it you must clear your concepts first and for soil science and anything allied to it uh, soil science soil science treatise was actually my go to and uh, towards the last two months i would say i went through agronomy in brief and agronomy in seconds these are the books that agronomy in seconds especially i did not ever try to Uh, memorize it it is not something you should memorize it's just something you go through right before your exam to cover wheat science as we all know it's a big chunk of our syllabus i have studied tk das and um, to cover the field crops i would very honestly tell you i have only and only studied the notes given to me by tricky agriculture uh, they prepared the notes actually from rajendra prasad all the way through and i kept reading those notes to understand the field crops so self study is an important thing in itself but uh, taking a tutor was a really important part of my process because all of us understand that agronomy ka syllabus is very huge you cannot keep covering everything there is no end to the depth of it so having a tutor actually helps you understand kya nahi padhna hai because there is no end to tum kitna pad sakte ho to there should be somebody who should tell you kya nahi padhna hai what is not important and the things that are important and actually uh, my tutors help me do that pretty well and uh, one another thing is every day you have a set time for lectures you have uh, set days for different tests so you are bound to something you have chaho na chaho you have to maintain a schedule a discipline is maintained so i think that was very important for me as a student uh, starting me like during the whole third year and also a fair part of the fourth year i was only focusing on clearing my concepts and towards the end like last ke 5 months i would say for to 5 months almost i actually went ahead to memorize things data and actual numbers and everything yaad karne wala part last ke months mein i did until before that i did not really try to uh, memorize everything and also one really important fact that i understood is no matter how much you study if you're not revising at the end everything will seem like exactly new and jaise kabhi pehle padha hi nahi hai i went ahead to take mocks from tricky, tricky agriculture itself so there were different mocks like uh, full syllabus then chapter wise and also we had mock tests throughout the years so the mock test actually gave me a good idea of uh, time management during the exam itself and also a race against myself a race, race against the people i was studying with and a healthy competition was all around so it was pretty good um, something i would like to tell you to do right before your exams is aakhri uh, ke 20 days mein don't try to study anything new jo pehle aata hai usi ko dobara you keep revising you keep making it stronger it'll actually boost your confidence and uh, during the exam just try to stay calm as calm as possible because there's a possibility ki wo sare panic mein you might actually um, lose the questions that you were you had in your hands already and another thing is paper is not really ever so tough it's always between moderate to easy so in case starting ke bhi you feel questions nahi ban rahe that's fine 
बिकॉज अगर तुमसे नहीं बन रहे हैं बहुत सारे लोगों से ऑलमोस्ट मेजोरिटी से भी नहीं बन रहे होंगे वो तो देर आर ऑलवेज अ फ्यू क्वेश्चन जो ना तो तुम्हें आएंगे ना किसी को आएंगे तो उनको देख के घबराना नहीं है कि कैसा आ गया पेपर एंड एवरीथिंग सो यू हैव टू गो थ्रू द पेपर एंड देर विल बी क्वेश्चन जो यू कैन जस्ट हैव इट इन योर हैंड्स बिल्कुल फर्स्ट राउंड में ही देन देर आर क्वेश्चन जो विल रिक्वायर योर कॉन्सेप्ट एंड वो कॉन्सेप्ट यू ऑलवेज रिमेंबर रेडी एंड रेडी विल बी एबल टू गिव यू सो and that's pretty much it good luck